When we attach the tag to the dorsal fin of the shark, the tag basically goes on like this uh, at a bit of an angle. There are two copper contacts, one here and one up here that essentially have a closed circuit when the tag is in the water. As the shark swims along, when it breaks the surface with the tag, breaks that circuit and wakes up the tag, that's when we get one of our location pings. If the shark stays at the surface for 10, 20, 30 seconds, we'll get a good fix on where the shark is. If it's just a, a transient ping, we may get what we call a Z ping, which is we know the shark is there, but we don't get good location data. And this is basically how these tags work. It's a pretty simple concept, but when you think about what goes into this in terms of a battery, it has to go through a satellite system overhead, and then it all comes down to our computers back in the lab. It's, it's really a miracle of science.